you. Nucleolus will be present today. We will talk about nucleolus characteristics, nucleolus also as to actual, nucleolus function, and quiz game. I'm Dr. Biomed, cellular and molecular biologist. Hi everybody, welcome to the Biomed Cafe channel. In this channel, complex biological and medical contents are presented in a simple, classified and summarized form. Nucleus structure. Nucleus has five parts in its structure. Nucleoplasm, nuclear lamina, nuclear envelope, nucleolus, and chromosomes. Nucleolus. Nucleus discovery. They saw something other didn't see. The nucleus was identified during the 1830s. Little was known about the function of the nucleus until 1964, when John Gordon and Donald Brown concluded that the nucleus had a function necessary for life. In 1966, Max L. Brinstel showed that DNA within nucleus codes for ribosomal RNA. Nucleus characteristics It is a spherical body within the nucleus of most eukaryotic cells. It is a dense non-membrane bound structure. It appears shortly after mitosis. It can be one nucleus to several in nucleus, depending on the organism and cell type. It is best known as the site of ribosome biogenesis. It is made of proteins, DNA, and RNA. It is one of the main components of the nucleus. Nucleus ultra structure. Nucleus has three parts in its ultra structure. The first part is fibrillar center or FC. These are the sites of ribosomal DNA or RDNA transcription and contain the genes that encode RNA. The second part is dense fibrillar component or DFC. These regions are composed of RNA and protein that have been transcribed and processed. And the third part is granular components or GC. These regions contain the mature ribosomal subunits that are ready to be exported to the cytoplasm. And nuclear vacuole. And nuclear vacuoles. It is present only in plant cells. The nucleus ultra structure can be seen through an electron microscope. Nucleus function. Number one, rRNA transcription and ribosomal subunit assembly. Number two, participation in the formation of signal recognition particles. And number three, participation in the cell's response to stress by regulation of mitosis and the progression of the cell cycle. Ribosome assembly steps. Step one, transcription of rRNA and producing a line precursor molecule or 45S pre-rRNA containing the 18S, 5.8S, and 28S rRNAs as well as transcript spatial regions. Step 2. Cleavage of 45S pre-rRNA and yielding separate precursors to the 18S and 5.8S plus 28S rRNAs by some small nuclear ribonucleoproteins or SNORNAs. 
Step 3. The assembly of the ribosomal precursor RNA with both ribosomal proteins and 5S rRNA for formation of ribosomes. Now I want to compare nucleolus with nucleus. Nucleolus is very small, but nucleus is large. Nucleolus has no limiting membrane, but nucleus has the nuclear envelope. Nucleolus does not hold any chromosomes, but nucleus contains chromosomes. Nucleolus is rich in RNA, but nucleus is rich in DNA. Key point of nucleolus. Presence and number of nucleolus is an identification. Presence and number of nucleolus is an indication of the protein synthetic activity of a cell. The nucleolus may change in appearance depending on the functional state of the cell. And the nucleus contains the genes that encode all RNA. Each ribosome contains ribosomal proteins which are synthesized in the cytoplasm. And at least one large molecule of rRNA and at least one small molecule of rRNA which are synthesized in the nucleus. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to this channel and if you like the contents of this video, please like it. Now it's time to the quiz game. I have put the link to the quiz game in the description of this video. Download it for free and enjoy it. Until the next video, bye!